Leroy Joan for is a Dutch professional footballer who plays as a central midfielder for Queen's Park Rangers and the Netherlands national football team. For has various nicknames. In his youth he got nicknamed De Witt Smiter by Feyenoord youth coach John Paul van Gastel for his strong physical appearance. Other nicknames are Lera and Fravik. Kophot, coach of the Netherlands U21, compared for with Patrick Vieira. According to Pot both players show many similarities, on and off the field. Early life, Fur was born and raised in Zutermia, South Holland, the Netherlands. He is the first child of parents of Dutch Antillian descent. Fur's grandfather was a football player on Curia Section No, while his father, Leslie Fur, was a baseball player. Fur has one younger brother named Lee Gregg, who played for the Feyenoord U-17 team. Fur was raised Catholic. In Zlatermia we went to church every day. God gave me my football talent. I thank him for that every day. On his right lower arm he has a tattoo of the Christian cross with the text in God I trust. Club career, youth career, Fur started his youth career at the local Zlatermia club DWO. In his first full season, Fur's team won friendly matches against youth teams from professional sides, like Sparta Rotterdam and Feyenoord. However, for stayed at DWO until the age of nine. Together with youth friend Card Ramstige, for accepted the invitation to join the Feyenoord Youth Academy. Feyenoord, breakthrough, for had his breakthrough in Feyenoord's first team in the season 2007 a Euro 08. On December 2, 2007, for made his official debut for Feyenoord under the management of Bert van Marwich. At the age of 17, for replaced Nuri Angström in, in the 84th minute in the Eredivisie home match against Heracles Almelo. Four days later, on December 6, 2007, for signed his first professional contract with Feyenoord, keeping him in de coupe until summer 2012. For was active in 13 Eredivisie matches in his first season, mainly coming in as a substitute. Due to injuries in Feyenoord's first team squad, for made his first appearance in the starting lineup in the Eredivisie away match against Ajax on February 3, 2008. For started on the right back position, which he continued to do so for four matches in a row. On March 30, 2008, for scored his first Eredivisie goal in the away match against NAC Breda. In the season 2008 Euro 09, for slowly became a first team regular. New Feyenoord coach Gudjan Verbeek often positioned for on the central attacking midfielder position behind striker Roy McCarr. On September 18, 2008, for made his official European debut, as he was named in the starting lineup in the UEFA Cup home match against Kalmar FF. Feyenoord lost the match 0 a Euro 1, but in the return match in Sweden for scored the winning goal in the 1 a Euro 2 victory over Kalmar FF securing a place in the group stage. During the season, various European top clubs showed interest in the Feyenoord talent, one of them being Italian side Juventus, but Feyenoord refused any cooperation. Recognition, for the season 2009 Euro 10, for lost his status as talent and grew out to be an important player. While for wandered through various playing positions in the previous seasons, from right back to striker, for was now constantly placed on the defensive midfielder position by new Feyenoord coach Mario Bean. On October 20, 2009, Feyenoord's new technical director, Leo Bean Hacker, criticized Feyenoord's first team squad, but at the same time praised for, for his importance within the team. Three days later, Feyenoord captain Giovanni van Bronckhorst even claimed for to be unmissable for the squad in Feyenoord TV while the Netherlands coach Bert van Marwijk admitted he was following Fuhr's development closely and was getting very optimistic about him for a possible call-up. For the 2010 Euro 11 season, Fuhr's importance for Feyenoord was illustrated after being named the vice-captain of the squad. FC Twente, Fuhr joined fellow Eredivisie club FC Twente at the end of August 2011 in a deal reported to be worth a £5 million. Fuhr played 71 times for the club scoring 21 goals over the next two seasons. On January 28, 2013 it was announced that English side Everton of the Premier League had agreed a deal, reportedly worth £8.6 million, to sign for. The deal fell through when a medical revealed the player had a long-term knee injury and Everton wanted to negotiate a payment by appearances fee. 
Norwich City, on July 13, 2013, Norwich City confirmed the signing of Fur on a four-year deal for an undisclosed fee. He made his dark copyright but for Norwich against Hull City. He scored his first goal for the club against Bury in the League Cup on August 27, 2013. He was awarded Man of the Match for an exceptional performance in a 1 Euro 0 home victory over Southampton on August 31. Fur continued his fine early form and was awarded Norwich's Player of the Month award and his fourth consecutive Man of the Match award after a 3 Euro 1 home defeat to Chelsea on October 6. Fur was involved in controversy in a 0 Euro 0 draw against Cardiff City on October 26, 2013. Teammate Alexander Tetty went down injured late in the match and Cardiff goalkeeper David Marshall sportingly put the ball out of place so Tetty could get treatment. However, during the distraction, Ricky Van Wolfswinkel took a quick throw into Fur, who rolled the ball into the net. Despite the goal not technically being in violation of any rules, the referee disallowed the goal as he had not blown his whistle. Players technically do not have to wait for the whistle to be blown to take a throw in. Cardiff manager Mulkey Mackay criticised for his lack of sportsmanship. For confirmed on match of the day that the shot was completely intentional and had not expected such a reaction from the Cardiff players, who surrounded him and started shoving him around. David Marshall also started to threaten Ricky Van Wolfswinkel. Leroy for scored the third goal in Norwich's 3 Euro 1 home win over West Ham United on November 9, 2013 and drew plaudits from the likes of Jamie Reedknapp for his performance. Reedknapp also stated his belief that Fur could become one of the stars of the league if he consistently plays as he did. Fur scored again in a 2 Euro 1 defeat against Newcastle United on November 23, a late header that only proved to be a consolation for the Canaries. He scored his third league goal for the club against West Brom in a 2 Euro 0 victory on December 7 and celebrated by imitating a flying canary. He also assisted Gary Hooper with a through ball that cut straight through the West Brom defence. He was given man of the match by Sky Sports for his performance. He was voted Norwich's Player of the Month for November via the club's official Facebook and Twitter pages. He was sent off against Crystal Palace on January 1, 2014 in the 82nd minute in a game which ended 1-1. Queen's Park Rangers on August 20, 2014, it was announced that Fur had joined newly promoted Premier League team Queen's Park Rangers on a three-year deal for a £8 million. International career, despite playing for the Netherlands on various youth levels, Fur was in doubt which country to represent, as he was eligible to play for both the Netherlands and Netherlands Antilles. In October 2008, Fur claimed he hadn't made a decision yet, personally I want to mean something for my island. That's why I'm still in doubt. My brain says it's better to choose for the Netherlands. Then you're assured of a big tournament every two years. But my heart is thinking of Kyrgyz Section O. It would be fantastic to play a World Cup with Netherlands Antilles, it would give the islands an enormous boost. My roots are stronger than my urge to a career, I'm striving for a higher cause. I don't know yet, but my feelings to play for Netherlands Antilles are very strong. However, on August 26, 2009, Fur announced he made the final decision and chose to represent the Netherlands on international level. He was selected for the Netherlands 23-man squad for the 2014 FIFA World Cup. He scored his first World Cup goal in the group match against Chile on June 23, 2014, after coming on the field as a substitute. Youth teams, Fur went through all the Netherlands youth teams but had most success with the Netherlands U-17, when the team qualified for the UEFA European Under-17 Football Championship. Netherlands U-17, Fur was the captain of the Netherlands U-17 on the 2007 UEFA European Under-17 Football Championship in Belgium. After a solid run through the qualifying rounds, without losing a single match, the team ended up in the group stage with host Belgium U-17. Iceland U-17 and England U-17. After a disappointing draw against Belgium U-17, the team came out victorious in the match against Iceland U-17, but finished on a third place in the group after losing the final match against England U-17. 
the Netherlands U-17 failed to qualify for the knockout stage and missed out on a ticket for the 2007 FIFA U-17 World Cup. Netherlands U-19, quickly after the 2007 UEFA European Under-17 Football Championship, forgot selected for the Netherlands U-19. The team underachieved and failed to qualify for the 2008 UEFA European Under-19 Football Championship in Czech Republic and 2009 UEFA European Under-19 Football Championship in Ukraine. Netherlands U-21 for made his unofficial debut for the Netherlands U21 on March 31, 2009. A temporary replacement team for the Netherlands U21, called the Netherlands B, played a friendly match against Italy U21, which ended in a 1 Euro 1 draw. On August 11, 2009, the Netherlands U21 started their 2011 UEFA European Under-21 Football Championship qualifying campaign with a friendly match against England U21. FA was part of the starting lineup in a match which ended in a goalless draw. Honours, Club, KNVB Cup, 2007 a Euro 08, Individual, Rotterdam Talent of the Year, 2008. References External links, Leroy for career stats at Soxabase, official Leroy for profile on Feyenoord NL, K Marouages Club, Leroy for, Boatball International, Leroy for, Holland Stats at Onsorangi.